So these are mentors of mine. This is uh, Lottie Hemian and Carl Hemian. There were a lot of people to look up to when Sean Farquhar was just starting out. Mandrake the Magician uh, was my childhood hero. But the biggest inspiration comes from the family tree. So my dad was uh, William Graham Farquhar. He taught me the basics with coins and things. Four generations of magicians, starting with his great-grandfather. He did a lot of pocket magic tricks, the stuff that you just take out. There were some tough times for Farquhar in those early years. I stood in front of dart boards that it was the only bright light in a bar. I have no idea where None worse than the day when he lost everything in a new Westminster apartment fire. But you got to have a good attitude. Risking the flames to help others escape. Pounded on 12 doors before going back in. I was a scrawny little guy and I don't know where the adrenaline came from, but I did what needed to be done. He's built a long, successful career working cruise ships with his wife, touring the world and appearing on talk shows. That's an excellent choice. One the two-time world champion of magic was the first to stump Penn and Teller twice on their show Fool Us. Window, am I right? It's something else completely different. Oh, fool on you! In a podcast, uh, they said, what's one of the you know, most memorable moments? He said, oh, I remember the time Farquhar came up for the second time and we just went, oh no, we're going to lose. Now Sean serves as a mentor to younger magicians with a place to call his own in New West. So Hidden Wonders is this little speaky... <clears throat> Sorry, Hidden Wonders is this little speakeasy magic theater. I wanted the big 750 seat theater and then later it was the 150 seat theater and then I realized that, that I want to do sleight of hand and to do that I can't have more than 30 people. Standing in there? A dream he's always had since the day he started this journey to carry on the family legacy. My magic has always been in seeing the expression in other people. You can have the worst day in the world and if you do something magical for them, all of a sudden they lose that horrible feeling just even for a glimpse. <laughs> Jay Durant, Global News. If you know someone who has a great story to tell or something unique to BC that people need to know about, email your ideas to me at thisisbc at globalnews.ca.